The following is a summary of the Holy Father's words this morning. Dear brothers and sisters, in our continuing catechesis on the Our Father, we now turn to the first of the seven invocations, Hallowed be thy name. Here we see the pattern of all prayer, which is always made, on the one hand, in contemplation of God, and on the other, in a sincere supplication for our needs. When we speak to God, He already knows us better than we know ourselves. For even if God is a mystery to us, we are not an enigma in His eyes. He is like a mother for whom a simple glance enables her immediately to perceive the condition of her children. A first step in prayer, then, is to entrust ourselves to God and His providence. This leads us to pray, hallowed be thy name, where we not only express our trust in God's greatness, but also ask that his name be sanctified in us, in our families, our communities, and the whole world. We can do this because it is God who sanctifies and transforms us by his love. Prayer casts out every fear, since the Father loves us the Son lifts up his arms to support ours, and the Spirit works in a hidden way for the redemption of the world. Benedicta vos omnipotateus, Pater, et filius, et spiritus sanctus. Amen. Would you like to see the Pope up close and personal? Download the Rome Reports app right now on your phone. There are versions available for both iPhone and Android, in Spanish and English. You will receive the best images of Pope Francis every day right to your cell phone, including his daily homily, his trips around the world, his meetings with global leaders, his acts of mercy to the needy, all this in a short and direct format, brief videos of one to two minutes, so you can watch wherever you are. Open your cell phone now, download the Rome Reports app, and follow Pope Francis everywhere.